this very simple scarf uh, for beginners uh, we will start with 21 stitches and this is how I um, do um, how I cast on in the middle now under the, this uh, uh, yarn over the yarn loop through under over through one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one let's count two four six eight ten two four six eight ten twenty one now we have to knit six rows just knit knit by the way this is continental style knitting okay Now I usually slip my last stitch, okay, I slip my last stitch, slip from left needle to right needle, then when I turn around, then I knit it, and again, knit, knit, so this is second row. slip last stitch slip turn it out and knit my third row slip last stitch you don't need to knit it turn it around this is my fourth row slip last stitch from left needle to right needle and just knit this is my fifth row slip move on to the right right needle my sixth row to the right needle and I'm starting seventh row <clears throat> uh, actually I'm starting eighth row the first row was the cast on okay so in the pattern that is written on my blog this would be eighth row and now we will do um, uh, the second 
um, style, second um, uh, design, and that is you knit, then you knit second again. So on always the first two are going to be knit, knit, and then the pearl, pearl, and now this and this will repeat. So knit, pearl, okay, knit, pearl, 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 knit, slip, turn around, and then you do the same again, knit, knit, pearl, knit, pearl. Turn it around and again knit first stitch, second stitches knit, and now it's pearl knit, pearl knit, pearl knit, pearl. Now I want to explain uh, what is um. Um, and happening. you know that if you start knit, purl, knit, purl, knit, purl, knit, purl, now you go and knit. So your purl stitch becomes knit and knit stitch becomes your purl stitch. And you really don't have to um, watch it that much uh, if you have odd number of stitches and um, and you just uh, do the same, you know, in the beginning, do, do the same thing. So, which over here, you slip the stitch, then you turn it around, and then you do those two knit, knit, and then purl, knit, purl, knit, purl, knit. Okay, so you don't really have to watch it as carefully. It just becomes very natural lore, you know. Although you can see it, you can see it over here that this this is kind of knit, and this has to be pearl. And this one is pearl on this side, so it has to be knit. I hope that I'm trying to explain it um, in a way that everybody understands. And um, here we just want to, now I slip the stitches, I was waiting to explain why I slip stitches, because this edge becomes kind of nice looking, okay, that's why I slip always the last stitch, okay, so the scarf looks uh, you know, you don't have to really do anything with that edge because that edge is really nice looking. And the scarf is really easy. It's just uh, knit and purl and yet you get a really nice style. Now here we have to do ten, um, uh, 10 rows. So this is my one, two, three, four, five. And I'm now at the sixth row. So knit and purl, knit and purl.
time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, yes. Slip stitch. Okay, so now we had six rows over here of uh, garter stitch and then we had ten rows of this stitch. So six rows, ten rows. Now we're going to repeat six rows and then after we finish six rows we will do ten rows of this particular stitch. Just knit. This is the uh, six rows of only knit. No purl, just knit both rows, both sides of the knit. That's what I meant. Slip stitch. slip stitch. Okay, and now we would go and do four more rows of knit, just knit, and then we would go and start doing this design, ten more rows of this design. Okay, so this is how you can go and create that very easy uh, scarf.